I think I'm a pretty good guy. <laughs> I agree. It's just fun to be the bad guy sometimes. Do you prefer um, more heroic roles or villainous roles? I don't prefer anything. And sometimes when you think you're playing a villain and then suddenly something's revealed and you go, why is this guy perceived as villainous? I just always think it's more fun to be the bad guy. And even when I was wrestling, you know, I like being the bad guy for some reason. But you know, I will take a character, if it's a good character, I don't care if he's a good guy, bad guy, as long as he's interesting. The thing is that I, I want to have a varied diet. So I, I mean, uh, right after I've done nice guy like Bill, I, this is, is a pleasure to do a guy like this. Do you think the right ABBA song could fix the Baron? Absolutely. Do you have one in particular? I mean, I was dancing for uh, two months, I think, to Volevu, so he does not want to hear that one. It's not a sort of psychological role that, that you, you have to be fine-tuned psychologically. And, I, and you can play him in many different ways, but you have to make him physically impulsive and uh, make him so strong that he can have a few scenes only and he will be remembered throughout the film. I, I don't like those kind of stereotypes of like, this guy is this. Even when I played Dan White, it was like, can I feel compassion for this guy even though I hate him? I hate what he did, I hate his thought processes and all that. And then I remember asking Gus Van Sant at one point, maybe we should just have him walking down City Hall and you just follow me so we can see him thinking. You know, what What could that moment be like? And I think that that's, I mean, that's what's great about playing villains and this and that is you take away the titles and you go, how would the human being react? You know, we're all flawed in some way. You get a little bit more screen time with Javier Bardem in this, in this film. Exactly. How did it feel, you know, to reunite with your No Country for Men? I love Lenny? him, man. I just love hanging out with him. I love who he is as a human being. I have massive respect to the choices he makes. I love the movies that he does. I don't care if it's La La Crocodile or if it's No Country or what. I watch everything he does. I love him. And yeah, it was the first time somebody just pointed this out the other day, and I didn't even know this because we spent so much time together, that it was the first time we ever had an exchange on film was Dune. So that was nice. Yeah, that was that nice. nice. That was kind of giddy for us. <laughs>